Well, hello everyone. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. It's Doc. And today I am really excited to finally announce we have a whole new zoo series coming in to my channel. And it's going to be an East Coast based zoo. Or if, if you're European and you don't know much about the East Coast in the US, then you can just, you know, imagine it as a West Coast, like Belgian or Dutch Coast type of zoo. I mean, it's, it has a lot of inspirations from a lot of different parts of uh, the Atlantic. So, the what I wanted to achieve with this was that I am really, you know, in love with the coastal pack. But I didn't want to go the whole tropical coast route. I just, I don't do well with tropical stuff in this game. Especially because my PC specs just aren't built for it. Like, I cannot build on tropical maps too much either. Because I lag really easily. And my entire idea with this build was that I would be able to, yeah, make this cozy, nice zoo... And a lot of it is also based off of the Folklore album by Taylor Swift. I love her music. If you know me personally, or if we've talked before, you already know this. But for those of you who don't know, I'm a big fan of hers. And yeah, this zoo, I have to say my thanks. Because I was just, you know, I had this map open. And I was listening to her music. Because usually what I do is I either listen to true crime podcasts. Or I, yeah, just listen to podcasts. Or... I listen to music when building something. I cannot watch something when building. I used to be able to do that. I used to watch like Family Guy or American Dad. But I no longer can do that. I My attention span has, you know, changed a bit since I've finished doing my master's degree. And now I just like listening to things. And I was listening to Folklore. Specifically, I was listening to Last Great American Dynasty. That track is a beautiful track by Taylor when building this entire, like, two building entrance. There's another building. You'll probably see it in the cinematics i don't know if i'll put the cinematics yet in the yeah beginning or the end but probably it will be in the beginning so you guys can get an idea but i'm i'm very proud of the results of this zoo here i'm just yeah deciding what to do with these like several grand entrances this building isn't just a shell either so there's a few things in it one of the main things about this building is that it is yeah like i said not just a shell and it houses, I think, if I'm not mistaken, a veterinary surgery. There should be a staff room in here as well. The other building I'm copying things from, you'll see me copy things from that so that the theme kind of fits uh, across the street, is um, like includes the keeper hut because there's also an exhibit there. Like right next to the implied salt lake slash beach thing I made, there is a butterfly um, walkthrough. That is kind of hidden so you don't see like there's no netting there's nothing so i thought of it as like a natural butterfly walkthrough in on the beach for king uh you know, monarch butterflies and yeah i as far as i know they also you know when they migrate they also stumble upon beaches sometimes it just made sense to me it also was a way to draw guests in there because i might make a pier there at some point and just like make it more beautiful Anyway, you'll see me doing a lot of window framing here. It, like these limestone pieces are gorgeous for framing the windows and the rest you can just do yourself. Now, the inside looks odd, but we, this big building will have a restaurant in it later. Like um, we will decorate it again. Like they'll do a whole renovation, I think for this zoo at some point, because obviously I want to get started. So I'm making things as good as possible in the beginning. And then later on, I'll fix some little, you know, I'll do some touch ups. I also have difficulty breathing today. I, I don't know why, like I've, got, I've gotten tested for COVID and I don't want to talk about that a lot, but yeah. Oh, actually at all. I just can't speak properly when I'm doing the voice recording, which is not something I'm used to. And this is a very long video. So at some point I might just let you enjoy the, you know, lo-fi audio and just the building of the zoo. I think the building style itself speaks for itself. Here I'm just making some custom benches. I think, um, yeah, the custom benches thing is good and important to do, especially from my point of view. Um, as as much as I love some of the benches in the game, like not all of them are, you know, basic in my eyes. Some of them just don't fit themes. Like I cannot make them fit into anything, so I just make these custom things. Ooh, guys, I'm out of breath again. The whole idea I have this with this, you know, is, yeah, like you enter, you get your ticket across the street, which is the, the, the thing I'm going for. And then you're waiting for someone. You're waiting on your date. You're waiting 
on your friends or your family to park or do something and you don't want to answer the zoo right away so you just sit there and wait for them under the wisteria and the wisteria is also a reference to taylor swift here i took a lot of inspiration from uh, farmhouses in nashville like this is the restaurant there's an inside and outside section we'll finish it up with like really really modern uh, doors that are flippable doors i don't know the name of these doors so if anyone knows let me know but I've seen them on Architectural Digest, so I tried to replicate some things I've seen on different architecture uh, magazines. Uh, you can probably hear me like taking a big breath of air. I'll get this checked with the doctor as well as soon as possible. But yeah, so for the rest of the video, I just want to leave it here before I start dry heaving, making this um, audio. This is the second day that I'm trying to make a voiceover for this video. It just is not going to work. Like I'm out of breath. I have to constantly take really deep breaths in and then I have to edit them out of the voice file which is very very annoying when you have a long audio file like this. So for the rest of the video all I want to say is thank you so much for supporting this channel and if, if you like my video, if you like my editing styles, let me know and drop a like you know for this video that's one of the things you can really do to support our, uh, us creators here on this platform. Woo! And if you want me to make more content that is more, you know, tutorial based, because some people have asked for that uh, on my DMs, then let me know. I'll, I'll already have some pretty zoo making uh, tutorials on the way where I'm going to show you guys how to make very simple and pretty builds. And if you like me overall, then I would love a subscription. But yeah, um, for now, I'll just leave you alone with the video and you'll see my socials pop up every once in a while and this beautiful soundtrack that I found on YouTube. And I'll see you next time with the California sea lion habitat build. Bye for now.